Oh, oh, not really, but I heard many things. Only I know chinte and uh, mingalaba. Of course, mingalaba is same, same like in the Philippines, mabuhay. And um, what is this? Uh, tezuba, right? Am I speaking right? Tezuba. Tezuba. Because I want the accent. It's very sweet. Tezuba. Oh, it's long. It's long. So at the moment, I need to learn more. Bear with me, guys. Honestly, I will learn more. Give me more time. Um, because every time I travel around the world, I study the, the culture. So in order to do that, because you know, guys, I'm quiet, liberated. I always wear bikini or topless, stuff like that. I'm very known with topless, bikini, stuff like that. But in country of Myanmar, I just realized that most of the people here are very, are very conservative. So in order to do that, I must wear long G to respect the culture, to respect the people, and to respect the country. And you know, honestly, I'm in love to wearing long G because I don't need to get any attention to get naked or topless in my social media. Long G is so good to wear. It feels like, oh my God, I feel so innocent. And every time I will, I, I wear long G, most of the people is like, they really admire me because, you know, Wearing some of the traditional dress from, from foreign is something like a big. So I'm very happy with it. You guys never heard. You watch the video, right? Yeah. Oh my God, it's so funny. Well, first of all, when Tonton portrayed my character in one of the events shows, I was amazed with him because it looks like real me on stage. He really copied my style, my moves, and the way he shouts out. It's same. So I'm very happy with it. Of course, when I heard as well from my friends, from my local friends, that um, Tonton is uh, one of award-winning academy celebrity here in, in, in Myanmar. So I said, oh my God, he must be very talented. Because in order to get this kind of honor, it's like you must work hard for this job. So I really fancy to meet him. So we met, I got a chance to meet him yesterday and he gave me a bouquet of flowers and as well um, a long G I wear it today. This is from Tonton. Thank you so much, Tonton. And of course, actually he asked me my headband to give it to him, but it's I don't have much, so I feel so sorry. I will give him a gift very soon because I know we're gonna meet it soon. And yeah, by the way, go back to Tonton. Thank you so much because he is such a very kind person. I'm very happy and very humble and when I met him he brought his family as well his mom and his dad I met his whole family and I'm so overwhelmed with that we had a great dinner and we made a video for all of you did you watch it's already 1.4 million views in just 12 hours uploaded my god it's so fun we did that video for all of you actually he don't know about it so when I arrived I got two high heels I told him that we make a video and we take a photos and he was surprised and he agreed with me He's so genuine guy so I'm very happy to meet him and I'm looking forward to meet him again and you never know in the future guys maybe me and Tonton were working together so let's see when God when with God with, with God terms oh oh my god first of all the planning of my birthday is I think it's gonna postpone because my birthday is November 2nd but because we are going back from Bagan to Yangon because we started shooting of the movie on the 28th so finish is we got going back to Yangon on the on the second of November. It's my birthday. So honestly, my my real plan for my birthday because every time I do my birthday, like five years ago, I did this. I always do spending time with a less fortunate people or into charity or orphanage. So in my upcoming birthday, I will promise and make it sure to all of you guys that I will spend one of the orphanage here in Yangon. The children probably, they need our support and I want to make my birthday memorable here in Myanmar. In order to become a memorable my birthday, I want to spend time with them, um, give foods with them, give some gift with them. I got already gift from them and then I'm so happy to be spending time with them because for me, during my birthday, it's always a traditional to spend with the people who really needs our help, the less fortunate people, the people that inspired me a lot, the people who is number one in my heart, and that is the people or the less fortunate people, and thank you.